Good to have you along on this Thursday. I'm meteorologist Matt Scott. Forecast looking okay in terms of the rain, and we'll talk about why in just a second, why it's so important. We've got rain uh, overnight. We had a little. We got some afternoon showers. Going to keep an eye on some thunderstorm potential. It's warm today. It's much cooler, but seasonal Friday and into the weekend, a holiday weekend, looking great. Yard goats home opener tonight. And we'd like to get the game in, and I think we have a good shot of it. I think the rain is going to be limited. The sky conditions are going to be, well, the temperature is going to be warm, starting out first pitch in the mid-60s. We've got breaks in the clouds this afternoon. Later on tonight, we're going to start to see uh, the clouds fill back in and some showers, part of this front that's been causing a lot of havoc across the Midwest and the Ohio Valley. I think the heavier rain stays down to the south. The thunderstorm potential is going to be over the mid-Atlantic. Notice we were in a level one, a marginal risk for storms last night. Storm Prediction Center has taken that out and seems to think that the thunderstorms are going to be really close by. But in terms of getting anything severe around here, again, fingers are crossed. But things are looking good. Watch the guidance as we go into the afternoon. You'll see a little bit of that rain coming through. But here's 6 o'clock. We'll go into 7 o'clock. Again, it's dry in Hartford. But watch down to the south. You're going to see a little more intensity with the cells. Not much at 8 o'clock. Again, maybe a drip or two for the game at Duncan Park. But by 9 o'clock, things are quiet. Now, after that, we'll, we're definitely going to get that front passing through. And you're going to see what looks like some really colorful stuff just a few miles south of us over Long Island. It does bear watching, but I think we're going to be okay. And then as we go into tomorrow, things are looking better. We quiet down the forecast, get some sunshine in, and it's looking good for Good Friday. Here are your chances for precip. You can see it starts to spike a little bit, 6 to 8 o'clock, but we're not looking for much. And then tomorrow, uh, you know, <laughs> we don't like to see this you know, on our scoreboard, but zeros beginning to end. You know, although if we pitch a shutout, that's good too. Here's the call. Mid-70s for your highs today. You'll see the winds shift from the southwest to the northwest. That's the front passing through. Tomorrow, more seasonal temperatures in the mid-50s with clouds and some sunshine in there. And it looks good not just for Friday, but for Saturday with the uh, big Yukon uh, Huskies parade for the men celebrating their national championship in basketball. Parade time, 50 degrees, a decent amount of sunshine. We'll hold the sunshine in there for Easter Sunday, too. Take a look next week. Maybe warm. It may be even warmer for Thursday and Friday. We may see 80 degrees. That's a look at the Madcast on Fox 61 Plus, fox61.com. Of course, next broadcast at 5 and 6 o'clock. Have a good day.